Hello, my name is Tuma Daniel, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to use the IQ Cent um, trading platform for your bro um, for your binary trading. How to buy and sell. Now, on the platform, on the left is um, the currency pairs. Now, on the right, uh, also on the left, you see the amount that the currency pair is paying out at that given time. Now on the right, you get uh, to see uh, your balance, also your the time of your the time you want to use for your trade, even if it's one minute, two minutes, and so on and so forth. So you can just select it and always allow the fixed time to be off. Now you can also put in the amount you want to use for each transaction. Now the call button is for um predicting that the price is going to go up so if you click the call button like i have clicked now i you see the up arrow showing that price should go up now if i click the put button it shows a down arrow that price should go down now one of my trade is in loss right now the trade that is in loss i can decide to buy more time for the trade by clicking the rollover button which is right at the edge of um, right at the edge of uh, this particular platform please note the rollover, rollover button will only appear after you have entered a transaction if you are in profit the rollover the rollover button is not going to appear it will only appear when you are in loss now the double up button which is here is an indication that I want to put the same transaction in the remaining time frame. In the remaining time frame, look at it. Because I, I, I trust my analysis that the price is going to go up. So when I click the double up, it puts an, a fresh transaction with the same time frame, which is with the remaining time. With the remaining time. So if you trust the analysis that the, the, uh, the price is going to go up in the remaining time you just click the double up so you enter a fresh position with the amount the same order size as your previous one so that is all you need to know for the iq send setup remember always choose the time make sure you choose the right time frame from your analysis now choose the amount of money because immediately you can't log into the website is going to show a ten dollar default it's always going to show ten dollars default so you almost always change put your order size before you enter any given trade and that will be all for now um, all right see you in the next video where i'll be explaining more on the binary options trading